Okay, so most of us love generating content with tools like VO3 or Sora 2 or WAN 2.5, but let's be real, these tools are way too censored and have so many heavy restrictions. So, in this video, I'm going to be sharing some of the best tools for generating uncensored content. And the best part is that they are all open source and completely free with zero restrictions. This isn't about generating illegal content, it's about exploring the limits of AI creativity and finding out which platforms can actually generate uncensored content. One more thing. None of these brands have paid me to do this. I'm just sharing it to you because most of these tools are hidden and not many people know about it. But Manny AI is always here to deliver. Anyways, if you want more real tests like this with honest results, make sure to drop a like and subscribe to the channel. And for today's video, all the necessary tools used will be in my Discord. So don't be shy. The link's in my description. Let's get started. Okay, so firstly, we're going to be trying out some open source tools on Hugging Face AI. Everything I will be showing here today will be completely free. So, as we open up this tool, we can see many AI models, like the Quen 2.2 and even Microsoft, and so many other AI models. So, the dashboard on the top that says, Spaces, we're going to click on that. Now there are even more models, like Gemini, Quen, and others. Now, let's click on Image Generation to check some things out. We're going to mostly be looking out for models that can generate uncensored content for free. Now let's try this model. When you click on it, they usually show a warning. So, let's start with a basic prompt. We will be generating an image of a girl in a park, and within seconds, it was able to generate the image so fast and without causing a glitch. Let's try something else, like generating an image of an apple. Okay, so it did generate the image, but I believe it can do better. Okay, now that's better. So, this tool is mainly used for generating uncensored and NSFW content and not usually used for basic things like an apple, but it still is able to generate the image properly. So, as you can see, the apple was generated alongside the woman, which I'm not surprised because the tool was made for generating images with people. Now, let's head back to the homepage, and remember, all the links will be dropped in my Discord. So, if you want the Discord link, it will be in the description. Now, let's try another NSFW image generator. We're going to generate something simple, like an image of an apple, just like before, and this tool was able to generate the image much better. Next, we'll generate an image of a bunch of women wearing clothes and smiling. I had to add the clothes because the tool is so uncensored. So, here you can choose to change the style, and this setting right here, you can choose to change the setting from Flux or the uncensored module. So, let's just stick to Flux, and we'll try something basic. It was able to generate the image seamlessly. Now, let's try another model. This model is my personal favorite. It has the uncensored version of Quen 2.2. We will try the prompts that were already here, and the generation came out clean, and you can hardly tell that it's AI. So, some of these open source tools can be a little bit difficult for some low-end GPUs. So you might want to be careful so that you don't burn or crash your PC. This last tool can generate videos from images, and it also has a text-to-video option. Let's try another free platform for uncensored content generation. It's called Mimic AI. There are things like Comfy UI, Face Fusion, and so many other tools to choose from. As you can see in Discovery, we can see some things generated using this platform, mostly with Comfy UI. They are pretty basic, but not bad. Let's check out some of the AI generators. Most of them can handle prompts with minimal effort. In the tutorial hub, we can see some models like Nano Banana, Sea Dream, and Quen 2.2, and even Sora 2. Let's head back to my apps and use the Auto 111 Web UI. We will be choosing the Flux UI for this generation. They have a text-to-image and image-to-image -image generator. Let's generate an image of a woman in a bikini. The generation looks okay, but doesn't really look like quality. Let's try changing the UI to all. Let's put in the negative prompt for it to have no distortions or weird body parts. Let's generate, and the generation looks a lot better. Now there are other models to try out, but they may be a bit advanced for some of you, so I'll just leave that part out. 
but you are free to go try them out after the video is done. So, we are going to try one last free uncensored generator, and the name is Digin AI. I have made a video on it before, but we will be using it one last time. So, they give free 300 credits per day, and they have Sora 2, Nano Banana, and other cinematic visual effects. Let's just click on the Create button. So, this tool doesn't have a text-to-video generator, but it can generate images, which you can then turn to a video afterward. Let's generate an image of a woman in the bathroom wearing a bathrobe. So, as you can see, the image came out clean, with no weird body parts or glitches. Next, let's turn the image to a video with a simple prompt. Now, there are tons of visual effects to choose from, but we aren't interested in that for now. So let's just generate the video, and it came out cleanly. Now I hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like and subscribe.